a quick guide on how to quickly sort out your inventory. For example, let's say you have run a dungeon, you've got a bunch of gear in your inventory, and you don't know how to sift through everything. Well, let me quickly show you a way that I use to sort out through gear that I might potentially sell if it's a two perker. Maybe I get 500 gold for it, maybe I don't. But just quickly want to salvage everything that's not useful to me. To do this, you can go to the search bar, type in minus, and then square bracket. You can see there's the square bracket, and then I'll type in, for example, Bane. And then I'll close the bracket as well. Now you'll see all of these weapons. Because I put minus square bracket here, all of these weapons, if they don't have Bane, it will come up. But you still want to look at the purples. Maybe they're good two burgers. For, for example, Chain Fire, Refreshing Pillar. I'll probably keep that. But all of these weapons, if they don't have Bane, then you can probably salvage them. They're probably not as useful since most people will craft with the Golden Scarab. But Bane weapons always sell for something if you find the right weapon. So you can just quickly start salvaging the seals you probably want to skip. Yes, keep vicious, but it's not useful. Esmos, chain void. Named item, we don't really care about those these days. You can just quickly salvage through them and remove it. Keen vicious, not too bad, but obviously won't sell accuracy. The legendaries I'll probably keep, but you can see you can quickly work through it. And same comes for the armor. For armor, I usually do resilient or ward. For this example, I'm just going to do ward and see if there's any armor I don't like. The rings, you can look on your own. There's not some, not that much, but you can just quickly salvage through them. See, none of them have ward on them. Here and there, you'll probably find a resilient piece, but not the end of the world. You can see this legendary is awful. All of these are probably awful. In the future, I'll probably remove Bane and Ward, but for now, this is a quick guide on how to quickly salvage everything. You can do the same with Resilient. Now, if you remove them, you'll still see some items here that's bind on pickup that you probably want to salvage, but you'll keep all your wards and the other things. Hope this guide was helpful. If it was, give this video a like, and I'll see you in my next video.